Hello guys. Six months ago I created my review for the first version of this keyboard. It was Nufi Air 75 and today I want to show you the version 2 of this keyboard and this is like recently newcomer to the market, market of mechanical keyboards and this is a low profile mechanical keyboard. My first review and my first connection with this keyboard was successful. Uh, my opinion that it was a great keyboard. Let's see what we have today. So first of all, you will find inside the box the keyboard itself, right? You will have a pretty interesting cable, not standard. And also you will see the attachment uh, for the 2.4 wireless dongle storage which is also quite unique. You will have a key cap and key switch puller. You will have additional set of key caps and you will have as always pretty nice uh, stuff right from the Nufi, this poster. And this poster is also a quick help to understand what is a hot keys for RGB and other stuff. And also you will have manual and some stickers. So let's do the quick overview of the keyboard itself. So first of all, you will have the high quality aluminum frame, which is nice. But also as a difference from the first version, this is a clear case, right? Translucent design and you will be able to see the PCB uh, inside the case. And also you have this pretty nice metal stuff under the uh, sticker to, uh, you, you know, for safe transportation. And you have a two level adjustment fits on the back side. So this keyboard supports Mac and Win and Linux and Android and iOS. And also it supports Bluetooth 2.4 connectivity and wired connectivity as well. And um, what is interesting in 2.4 gigahertz mode, you will have 1000 uh, hertz pulling rate, which is a lot and good for gaming if you're planning to, to game. Uh, in Bluetooth, Bluetooth is 5.1, you will have 125 hertz. Let's switch to the keycaps and switches so for this review today i ordered um, this keyboard with moss tactile 60 gram it's pre pretty heavy uh, switches so if you don't know uh, how they works i'm i'm not recommending to start with this type of switches better to choose something from the red or um, Anyway, like any linear switches would be better for you because tactile is a pretty, this kind of tactile, pretty specific one. So from the keycaps point of view, you may see that this is OEM PBT keycaps and they are pretty, pretty good as always from this brand. So uh, also we have a RGB on this keyboard and even two additional uh, RGB lines on the left and the right side. For the RGB in general, we have uh, more than 20, 21 different uh, schemas, but I need to say that right now, for example, with a pretty bright light, it's hard to see uh, any of the slides, so it's not main part of this keyboard. But anyway, you can see this RGB even through the key. Uh, through the case. So these two RGB light bars on each side and they are not just for fun, it's also some functionality around it. Uh, the left bar uh, will show you caps lock and uh, connection mode and right side will show you battery level and system mode. One of the uh, like main selling point of this keyboard compatibility with QMK and VR software so you are able to customize everything what the software provides and do it even more custom for you right i'm not uh, saying that you can order different keycaps and another low profile switches from gatron 
so the battery uh, inside this case we have 4000 milliampere and you can use like around 40 hours with RGB and 220 hours with RGB off. It's time for sound test. As I mentioned, be careful while ordering the keyboard because this version is with pretty tactile switches and take into account that this is low profile so we have one millimeter less total travel usually it's four in this case it's a three millimeters so you feel this bump pretty early and it's a little bit strange i would say because i'm fan of the tactile switches and i'm always building for myself tactile switches keyboard but this one i rather to try something with linear or maybe less heavy because it's a little bit feel strange just my advice if you're looking for other mechanical keyboards please check my other videos on the channel thank you for watching and see you next time